Hey, how's it going? I'm Tristan Marchese. I'm the Value Stream Manager for Supply Chain Operations in Steele O'Brien. And today we have a huge project underway where we are doing a combination of a burrito velocity-based slotting strategy, uh, incorporating a uh, replenishment strategy into that, and as well as spatial consolidation. So if we take a look here, we see that this was kind of our current state. We have only about 10 or so SKUs on this level, and then we have about four or five or so on this level. So we only have a handful of SKUs in a bay, and then we turn over here and we have six rows of four, yielding 24 different slots per SKUs. So already right there, we went from 12 to 15 to 24 uh, SKUs. And as well as we used our burrito analysis, our data to configure precisely which spot goes where. Um, standard burrito stuff of we have the highest velocity in this aisle over there, and then as we move down, we yield a slower velocity, trying to shorten that pick path, trying to do a little bit of a solution to that classic traveling salesman problem. Um, these here, cart and flow, are unique in that firstly we have them on wheels in case we ever have to do any sort of movement or anything like that again. There won't be much of a uh, huge labor investment in so doing. And furthermore, if we take a look here, suppose I am going to pick, so to grab one of these right here, all I do is slide it out a little bit, pick let's say two boxes of 25, come down over here, I find my 40 MPGRs, grab another one, here we have our picking there. And alongside this, the cool thing about cart and flow is that they're great for your middle ground movers, your B class or in the, our new vocabulary, our amongst our runners, repeaters, strangers, we have our repeaters in here. So what winds up happening is let's say this bin uh, empties out, somebody can pull it down. We have a full bin there for the remaining pickers for the next, let's say, week or so. And then we can just take this right over to our replenishment area with each of the bins marked with what item specifically. So replen takes about maybe not even 20 minutes. And that way we keep our constant flow. So. That's our project here. Uh, it's been a great time working together with Stream, with Trent, and uh, looking forward to future collaborations. All right, thank you, Tristan.